Okay, a debt is closely related to your business if your primary motive for incurring the debt is a business reason. So business uh, bad debt are mainly the result of credit sales to customers. In other words, sales on account. Or in other words, you do work, you invoice the client. If you're dealing with a bookkeeping system where they have accounts receivable on the books, that's most likely because they're in an industry where they have to track accounts receivable. And that means that they're typically doing an accrual type thing when they with with their bookkeeping on the revenue side of things. So if they have QuickBooks, for example, or something like that, any accounting software, and they have accounts receivable, the software is almost certainly, most likely at least, recording income at the point in time they record an invoice, which is increasing the accounts receivable. So that means they're recognizing revenue when they increase accounts receivable or send the invoice, even though they did not yet get paid. And if you're using that income statement, to input into the tax return, that means the revenue side is basically being calculated on an accrual method, and some of that revenue has not possibly been paid uh, them. Uh, in other words, there's timing differences with regards to you know, the revenue and then when the cash was actually received. So they can also be result of loans to suppliers, clients, employees, or distributors. So we can also have debts that are, that are resulting from loans that we we apply out. Who would we give a loan to? Possibly the suppliers, possibly our clients, right? We have clients that, that aren't uh, paying us, so we actually set up a loan for them. The difference between a loan and an accounts receivable is typically an accounts receivable is supposed to be paid within like 30 days or something like that usually, whereas a loan might have a more extended period and typically due to having a more extended period, of time between payments or before payment, interest will typically be charged. Uh, and employees are another common place where you might give a loan to uh, and or distributors. Okay, so goods and services that customers have not paid are shown in your books as either accounts receivable or notes receivable. So from just a bookkeeping standpoint, what's gonna happen when you make a sale on account? Accounts receivable goes up revenue is recognized at the point in time that accounts receivable goes up even though you haven't yet got the money if you loan someone money whoever it may be then cash is going to go out of the business you're going to be giving them a loan and the other side should be going to some kind of loan payable uh account um i mean sorry a uh, receivable account which again will be like an asset in a similar situation as accounts receivable so if you are unable to collect any part of these accounts or uh, these accounts or notes receivable, the uncollectible part is a business bad debt.